Hey there everyone, what's up and welcome back to another video on Film Top. Even though winning the lottery might seem like the best thing that could ever happen to a person, if one fails to manage the wealth wisely, it can become a nuisance quite easily. Here are 8 lottery winners who were once insanely rich, but ended up being broker than broke. But before we begin, make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos. Alright, now let's begin. Number 8. Wiv Nicholson After spending a majority of their lives in poverty, Wiv Nicholson and her husband Keith had never expected that their world would flip completely after their lottery win in 1961. Consequently, the couple decided to freely splurge on everything from expensive vacations to luxurious purchases. However, because they had failed to save enough money and plan wisely for their future, Wiv and Keith eventually ended up back in their former living standard. Moreover, after Keith's sudden demise, Wiv failed to regain all of their lost wealth. Number 7. David Lee Edwards David Edwards could not believe his luck when he won a whopping $27 million in the Kentucky Powerball 2001. However, the same wealth turned out to be a curse for him when it led him in the wrong direction. Edwards did not think twice before spending $12 million on private jets, expensive trips, luxurious mansions, and a fleet of premium vehicles. As a result, by 2006, he found himself penniless. Moreover, since all his wealth had gotten him addicted to alcohol and drugs, David was also diagnosed with a number of health problems. Because of his bankruptcy, he was abandoned by his wife as well and died alone in a storage unit, which had become his permanent home. Number 6. Sharon Tirabassi In 2004, Sharon Tirabassi's life took an unforeseen yet pleasant turn when she won $10 million from the Ontario Lottery and Gaming Corporation. Coming from a middle-class background, Sharon had never possessed this much money before she could hardly stop herself from going on extensive shopping sprees, lavish tours, and buying luxurious items for herself. However, in less than 10 years, she realized how she had wasted her wealth stupidly instead of making proper investments. After being broke, Tirabassi had to return to her previous standard of living. Fortunately, however, she did manage to save some of her wealth for her six kids, who would be receiving the money from the fund at the age of 26. Number 5. Pete Kyle Thanks to the Royal Bank of Scotland, Pete Kyle received an enormous £5 million following his win at the National Lottery in January 2005. It's natural for the lottery winner to celebrate with his family and enjoy the luxuries they were not able to in the past. However, Pete and his family did go overboard with spending carelessly on high-end purchases and countless vacations that were simply a waste of money. It is reported that Kyle was found spending £4,600 a day. Unsurprisingly, by 2008, he had to rely on unemployment benefits since his bank account was almost empty. Number 4. Marva Wilson it's not always impulsive purchases and unwise decisions that drain all your wealth. Turns out some lottery winners also become broke because of huge scams. One major example is Marva Wilson, who was granted $2 million after she won the 2008 Missouri Lottery. Being an innocent grandmother, Marva had little knowledge about managing finances and failed to guard her newly found wealth. Therefore, she fell prey to a well-planned scam set by a family acquaintance named Freya Pearson. Through sweet talk, Pearson earned Marva's trust and eventually stole all the lottery money. Despite the fact that the scammer was later sent to prison, Wilson was left with nothing as none of the stolen money could be regained. Number 3. Patty Big B Despite winning a million-dollar lottery prize, Patty Big B was completely broke in less than a year. By the time she had realized the reason behind her lost wealth, it was too late. Eventually, Big B decided to come up with a scheme that's horrifying as well as shocking, to say the least. With her 22-year-old daughter, Stephanie, Patty gave an advertisement on Facebook in an attempt to sell Stephanie's newborn baby for $75,000. 
Later, Patty's other daughter, Daniel, reported the incident to the cops, and Bigby found herself behind the bars for attempting to sell a child illegally. Number 2. John Roberts In 1998, a security guard with a mediocre lifestyle turned into a millionaire after winning the national lottery. With 3. million pounds in his account, John Roberts did not hesitate while indulging in extreme extravagance. From costly sports cars to lavish attire, he initially relished the experience of freely using all his cash. However, by 2001, Roberts realized that his wealth had completely depleted. In fact, he was £20,000 in debt and had to settle for living in a caravan because he could not even rent an apartment. Number 1. Jane Park Attaining £1 million after winning the national lottery at the age of 17 is not something that happens every day. Residing in Edinburgh, Jane Park was given the title of the youngest Euro millionaire in England, after which she found spending thousands of pounds on cosmetic surgeries and failed business ventures. In the end, Jane admitted how her newly won money added miseries to her life and got her into legal troubles too. These stories surely hold a clearer moral for us and for the future generations as well. Well, this brings us to the end of our video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you haven't liked the video yet, so it's never too late, give it a thumbs up, people. We will see you soon in another video. Until then, take care and goodbye.